with watch time being a key metric, playlists are a very important thing. They've moved things around, so I'm gonna show you how to make playlists in the new YouTube studio. Here we go. Now there's three ways that you can make a playlist in the new YouTube studio. First of all, go to playlists on the left hand side. This will currently dump you into a new screen where it lists all of your existing playlists very much similar to the style that the classic dashboard used to have. So you can see all of them here. I've got a fair few. In the top right hand corner, there is new playlist and you simply put in a quick title and you can choose the visibility of the playlist, public, unlisted, private. If you choose public, it will immediately go onto your profile, onto your channel at the front and people will be able to see that it's empty or how many videos it has or hasn't inside. Unlisted means that it won't be shown, but can still be accessed if you give the link to someone. Good for embedding on websites. And private means it's private. It's just for you. So I'm going to make this one passive income ideas. I simply click create. It now drops you into this screen here, where you're able to change certain elements of the playlist. So you can change your title. You can add a description. The description can be up to 5,000 characters long. So you can actually pad that out quite well with SEO. Just don't keyword stuff it because that can get you a community strike. You can use hashtags because they will show up as normal. You can share the playlist by using the little arrow. Under the three dots, you'll see collaborate, which you can share the playlist with somebody else. And then that way they can add videos to that playlist as well as you. Delete playlist is deleting playlist, of course. And then playlist settings. Now this gives you a simple pop-up. Allow embedding, that means that you can embed that in a website somewhere. Add new videos to the top of the playlist. I always use that one because when you add it, it then throws it to the top. Unless you've got a specific playlist in series that you want it listed from one to 10, for example, rather than 10 to one. And then you click done. This playlist will now show up as your normal options in your videos, or you can get it to auto add stuff for you. Go to the three dots, click playlist settings, click advanced settings. I'm sure they'll change the way this looks the next few months but the basics are still here once again you get your privacy so public unlisted private you get the ordering manual they added they added oldest most popular they publish they publish oldest over here there's an important button that says set official series or playlist now what this means is is that once again if you've got five videos that are clearly series videos that you're supposed to watch one two three four five you can put them in the playlist you can tell it that it is a playlist and that they are strongly related to each other and youtube will try and recommend them against each other under auto add this is where you get it to do some of the legwork for you you can get youtube to add videos to your playlist without you needing to do so yourself once they are published live the way it works is is you give it rules whether it's in the title the description or the tags. Now I've had in here a few rules. So if the title contains passive income, money, business, affiliates, or if there is a tag that's money, it will search all of my videos for me and auto add them. So when I click save, it now tells me you have created auto add rules for this playlist. And it's asking me, would you like to add existing videos that match these rules? So it's looked through these five rules and it says there's nine videos that it could add if they were new. So I click add and I click done. You'll now see that it's auto added these into that playlist for me. And then it's, it will continue to add stuff based on those rules. The second way you can make a playlist is by going to your videos page and start selecting videos. Now you can add them to your brand new playlist if you so wish, or you can click new playlist you put a title, you put in the visibility like we've done previously, and then it will start that process again where you fill in the playlist. The third way you can do it is go into a video itself, and then on the right hand side where it says playlists, you can scroll down and click new playlist. Also, you can add obviously videos into the playlist by clicking the little tick box. But if you click new playlist, once again, You've got your title, you've got your visibility, and that is how you can make a playlist. If you need help with any other YouTube features, there's a playlist here.